Hey guys, this is Rob Stanson with TISB Research and Development. This is uh, part two of the uh, Magneto Resurrection build. Um, here I got the I got the the wires all tied into it. I usually do like a pattern or wherever I feel the the energy hits the most and stuff. And uh, um, I'll do like sometimes an X or, or 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 an asterisk or whatever, pretty much like like that but you see how you got that so i wrapped these in between and then i and then i solder up against the magnets because the next layer is going to be uh um, copper and all this copper is two layers so uh by the time the energy gets past the moon metal and then it, it's going to hit one layer of, uh, of copper it's going to go to the ground uh, uh, the moon metal is gonna whisk it whisk it kind of goes away it kind of uh, it goes all the way to the end and, and goes down the energy but then if anything uh, so it'll slow down some of the energy and then it'll hit the uh, this this the top layer of the copper and it, and then it'll ground it'll immediately go ground and then you know once it shoots off to to flow out uh, um, to the ground that because it's plugged in I always plug them in. And we're getting up to that point too. Uh, let's see if I can kind of do this right here. I use these plugins right here. I get these at Harbor Freight. Um, you could do this to your bed too as well. Uh, these are like two dollars Harbor Freight. This right here, you get a spool of this for like probably like sixty-eight. Uh, um, dollars at, at Home Depot a uh, nice 100 uh, um, foot of uh, uh, ground copper 10 gauge and then what I'll do is I'll take these little prongs off this is the the uh, um, the pot the uh, hot and the, and the neutral you know so these are the two hot I take the hot out and I'll leave this prong in and then this will tie into here and I'll pull some of that ground cord and I'll, I'll pull about I don't know about a uh, eight foot, a good eight feet. Now that 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 makes it to where you can wear it. You can get up out of bed, you know, take it off, or you lay down and you pull the helmet off. I mean, one thing you got to understand: I require uh, at least three to six months of wearing uh, this helmet uh, 24/7 um, in order to to initially get that healing and and gain some ground, get uh, and heal, you know, to that point because when you get targeted you'll uh you'll get continuously hit and especially when you get the helmet you'll get c continuously uh hit because they but they already know um they should stop but once you get it the helmet um they already hit you every four seconds anyways whether it's light or hard and depending on your targeting uh um but when you especially get the helmet it's good to keep it off for about three months to get ahead of the curve of the damage that, that is already initiated. Because you got to remember, uh, every person on this planet is connected to this uh, these frequency supercomputer. You know, um, let me see. It's been since uh, when they first started this program, or or any programs at all. I mean, it was around the forties, you know, mid forties, and so that's a long time. Uh, um, well, actually, 40s, what was it, maybe 50s, maybe. Um, either way, I mean, his, his technology could have been around since the dawn of man, um, you know, by technology of, of, of past uh, um, uh, worlds, you know, um, after the equinox, the different equinoxes. Um, well, anyways, so what I'll, I'll get that, and I'll run about an eight-foot... Um, Sorry, I kind of ran off there. It's, it's crazy when you read the history on this stuff. But either way, um, you want to allow yourself some time to heal and get some rest, prop up some pillows, and, uh, you know, get on Facebook or, you know, go, you know, look around, shop, whatever. Do your thing. But just relax. You know, three months is, is actually, three to six months is actually a lot better than actually, uh, uh, than, than initially being targeted from birth, getting connected to this thing. You got to understand your brain, 
is connected to this connection, this, this Skynet AI, someone's freaking computer because they have your frequency of your brain, and then and then uh, uh, and. And and then, then they trans then they uh, uh, compute it and and, and uh, transfer it and, and and then next you know they're tapped into your brain, you know, but the connection that flows I could see it I can actually see it, um, you know with my naked eye, and well of course I, I wear these glasses too and I can see it a lot better but you can see the flow from the sky, you know and and and, and it hits everybody's head everybody's brain is connected to it. So you got to understand, from that time, when you were connected, um, the connection riddles your brain because it sits there all the time. That's why people get balding. Their, their hair starts receding and balding right there because that's where the connection is. And, and I, don't, I know nobody can see it, but I can actually see it. You know, the, the eye sitting on top of the person, you know, because it flows right there. And, and it will look at you, you know, and, you know, if that person's connected to that eye. Right there, and, and this is what they call souls, you know. And uh, um, I mean, even if you even if you research the Torah, you know, and and I watched a video just recently, and the way it spoke, and then uh, uh, God released the the um, you know off of Moses released uh, um, the angel that was tied to him that helped out, guided him, his guide, and. Uh, um, and, and release it to the highest, you know, uh, place and, and, and next to next to God, you know. But that was at the time when when they went to uh, when it was Moses's last day of living, and and so he Moses had to die. I guess. I mean, I don't. He was still alive. I mean, but they killed him, you know, and then put him down, you know, and and his and his soul. But it, what it is, it's the connection. It's the connection to the brain, and then. But these days, they do it literally. I mean, you know, I they must have researched it. Some CAA old retiree freaking kept that knowledge and then used it for him and his family or whatnot to take over the world, become gods. You know, but you know, either way, I uh, I got a lot more information on that. You know, and, and trust me, it's a motherfucker, uh, especially when when you know. Everything that what's going on and this and that and here you can predict things, and, and I mean I can find gold if I wanted to, you know I can find things you know that nobody else can find solve mysteries whatever blah blah blah, but what it, what we'll do uh, is because all those years say I don't know forty two years you know and you wore this helmet after um, about it took me a total of two years and six months for my brain to heal really good. But with all the other shielding, because the, the moon metal cap, the one I have on my head, um, well, it's three layers, two layers uh, um, moon metal and one layer um, brass, brass for healing. And it really feels good, you know, to the brain and stuff like that. Um, and, and, and it gives courage and stuff like that and the metaphysical properties. Um, it, this The energy, it really brings it out. That's why I have the helmet of salvation that I wear. And it's it's an enlightenment helmet. If I wasn't getting zapped all the time or hit with with uh, electromagnetic bullets, um, that helmet would be awesome. Because, but the thing is, is that those shoot a frequency to my brain and shoot it to my heart and try to give me a heart attack. And then, uh, but with uh, you know, but with this helmet I'm wearing now, because it's I got magnets and a mohawk that comes uh, top of my head and. Uh, um, and this is what keeps my brain shielded throughout the day because I can't wear this all day because, I mean, look at it. I mean, uh, this thing's pretty heavy. I mean, it's not that heavy right now, but it will get heavier, um, especially with all this material on it. And I'll be seeing here. You know, I mean, that's that's 600 magnets, both sides. And then what I do is, is I put a, um, a, little, a little hook right here and I solder it all in. And in this hook, what it's going to do is that this is where I'm going to connect your ground wire to. Um, and then what I'll do is I'll keep it in a loop. You know, it loops right here and another loop right here. And then I'll spin the, uh, the copper wire that's, that's, uh, um, that I stripped, you know, with some strippers. These strippers are really nice. These are kick-ass. 
I could start from the middle and then spread it up. Um, I do it on both sides. Depends on which way, which side you sleep on the most. If you sleep on your left side, you know, I'll, you know, I'll put it on uh, this side because you want it behind you, you know, the cord. And if you, you know, vice versa. Um, and what I'll do is, then I'll cover it. I'll, I'll, I'll solder it all down so it's strong, so it doesn't pull through. Because you got, you got to understand when it's in a loop like this, um, the, the, the wire that's plugged in the wall or, or into an extension cord. What is, is able to move move left and right up and down side to side and the reason why I do that is because so that that it's like this so it won't have a break point you know or a bend point because after a while it'll snap and uh, and, and then next you know you gotta freaking strip out some more wire and tie it in and you know do some do some uh, um, you know do some extra work when when it'll last a lot longer like this. So that's the whole deal with that. Um, so, so, so for, for two years and five months of healing your brain, and it was like three years where everything was beautiful. I mean, I'm like normal and everything else. I could still hear them a little bit, but it doesn't get shocking pains to my ears because of um, uh, my, my Ma Magneto's uh, ear uh, ear uh, plugs right here. So I got them on a leash. So if they fall out, I won't lose them. You know, because these things are precious. You know, and it's it's nice because I mean, it, everything's toned down. I'm not uh, extra sensitive to noise, to energies, to freaking fire engines, helicopters, and airplanes and going, oh my gosh, it's following me. You know, you know, that's that's, that right there has got to stop because no one's following you by an airplane or a helicopter or anything such like that. It's just they pull your attention to it. And, you know, come on. Planes are flying all over the place. It's probably a flight plan that they're supposed to go on. And they, they can't just, you know, go off of it, you know. That's probably the reason why. You know, I, I really wouldn't trip on that. Um, but it will make you think that people are following you. It will make you think all kinds of things. But once you heal... That shit's gone. Everything. I mean, if you want to be paranoid, all you want. But I guarantee you, it will drop. Um, the sensitivity will drop. Everything will drop. But you got to understand, if you're about 40, say if you're 40, that's 40 years. 40 years of, of uh, riddling of your brain. That's, that's, that's deteriorating your brain. It's clogging up your receptors because the... The, uh, you know, the fluoride in the water, the fluoride in your toothpaste, you know, uh, um, and all the other junk chemicals, that stuff clogs your receptors. So you're not getting, getting, you know, shots of, uh, uh, of excitement and you're running and you're, and, and, and it's like you're, nothing's helping you. You're, you're depressed, you know, because your brain has slowed down. Your brain slows down. Then your then your thinking slows. You're easily mind controlled, manipulated, twisted, mind controlled. You you name it. But this right here will will get the blood flowing, and good blood flow creates healing. Right? Look it up. It's it's on there. Guarantee it. Google will tell you. Um, and these magnets are 18 pound pull. I mean that's that's a lot. And then if you add it. When it's compressed uh, uh, with a rivet so hard that that, it, that all that energy is like two cars crashing into each other, and 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 with all these magnets, it's so so the frequency goes up and down, up and down, and it just keeps on climbing, you know. So basically, it'll catch it at low, higher, 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 and then it'll slow this electromagnetic bullet um, from piercing to your brain. Now, you will feel it a little bit. Then you'll get to that healing point where you barely even feel it. And then, because there's no way they can stop or stop the healing or damage your brain more or anything like that because they cannot penetrate this helmet. They have tried and it's been three years, three years, uh, one month, and geez, four days, you know. 
and, and I've been targeted for four years, but actually arrested all my life. And, you know, from a baby, targeted. Fucking great, huh? You know? Why? Sins of the fathers. Ah, you know? Bullshit. Shh, shh, shh. Now, come on, really? You know, these people tripping. Because you got to understand, these perps, you know, these people, they, they're, their brain is whittled too. It's damaged, you know? So over the years, it plus with their energies, fucking them up too, you know? Fuck them people. They're fucking themselves up. And it gets to a point where you know, you know, because I, I, know, I know what a tweaker sounds like. I know what a tweaker, how crazy their mindsets are. You know, where they're like, fuck it, we're going to rule the world, become gods. Uh, you know, and you're like, fucking wow. Ooh, yeah. You know, I mean, I mean, that's just crazy. I mean, that's just crazy, you know. And it's like, I mean, once you seek power and you know you're so close with NWO, you're like, oh, 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 and you're just fucking everybody up because all the people they're targeting, they're tied to them. Because it's a curse. Because once you tie into someone's apple, because you gotta understand the brains and and, and good and evil, uh, forbidden good and evil knowledge is, is in the brain as well. Where are the roots? You you chop the roots, the tree will fall. And and but the thing is, is that you know, you know they're they got to get free. And in order to get free, they gotta kill us all. So you guys gotta stay alive. You know. And some people think us that we're crazy. But it's not it. It's because freaking, I mean, we're not crazy. I mean, yeah, we're going through some crazy shit. But they need to understand, if it wasn't for us, these motherfuckers would be free on the street or targeting their asses. You know, they eventually, they probably will or they probably already are. Now, you're either on their side, they're going to fuck you anyways. Because you got to understand, it's freaking, you know, you know, at the end, we're the last in line. But the thing is, is that fucking, he's going to take every fucking soul. And he's going to take it, you know, he's going to get you, and he's going to kill you anyways. Guarantee, you know, at the end of your life, he kills you. You know, at the end of your life, all of them get you to that point where you have something around your internal organs, kidneys, fucking heart attack. Freaking, that's why it gets in the arm. Oh, and everybody grabs her arm. Why? Because our electrical system in our body fucking connects to the left arm to our fucking heart straight. The fastest way to our heart. And they could plug me right here. Well, they can't now because I got titanium just whisks energy off. And I learned something else. See this right here? This is a titanium choker. Yeah, it looks like a dog collar or whatever. But, I mean, I don't. I really don't care. You know, as long as I'm comfortable and I'm rolling, I'm chilling, I'm, I'm normal. As I used to, except for I look like, a, like some dude that you saw after Vietnam and stuff like that. Like, he's seen some shit. You know what I mean? And, uh, um, you know, and, you know, I used to ask myself when I was a kid, when I see these guys dressed look like they got back from the NOM and, and they, they got that, just that look on them and they're like, fuck, I bet that guy knows some shit, you know, or he's been through some shit or fucking knows some things that nobody else does, you know? And I never asked him anything, but <laughs> guess what? <laughs> I'm that guy. <laughs> Cause I, I, I can answer any damn question you got, you know? Even if it's one of those questions that freaking blow everybody's mind, can't figure it out, and they're like, yeah, I know. But anyways, uh, enough of that right now. Um, but I'm telling you, the most beautiful thing about getting free is this helmet. The armor of God is, is literally just a catalyst, you know. I can wear just this helmet. The, if I if I were the uh, uh, Magneto uh, Resurrection SS, and that has no copper, it's just straight blown out fucking magnets. Boom, boom, boom. And, and and if they try to get to your heart, they can hit you directly to your heart. They won't do it because why? They need two things: your brain and your freaking <laughs> and your freaking organ, you know, to get it. Trust me, because the thing is about legion, legion, because Jesus it said it right there in the Bible. The Bible was to let us know to help us out so we don't get there. The Bible wasn't meant to follow it step by step. The, far, the Bible history repeats itself, that bullshit. You want to know why they say that? Because humans keep on doing the same mistake because everybody wants power. 
power brings you to evil because the evil one knows it and he'll take you and then he'll take over your mind and next you know you're psychotic you'll be killing everybody on this earth and you'll be all alone better listen to someone who knows what he's talking about you know but I'm telling you you know if you you know right there on my post and go ah oh, have you seen your psych lately or this and that and here you know let me tell you something dude in the end I tell you what you know the angel of death will tell you straight up you're probably wrong about this guy you're wrong about that guy not with this you know you know this is what I am <laughs> oh because <laughs> I'm going to get it towards the end watch watch I'm going to get it pretty bad but either way um you know, you know, I, I'm an angel. You know, I mean, I, I it just, you know, Metallica would call me freaking uh, uh, misery. You know that song, misery. Uh, um, you know, the world on your shoulders and stuff like that. I try to let it go, but it's like nobody's doing something. Like nobody's doing really anything, and and I stumbled upon, uh, literally freaking the. Uh, <coughs> 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 You know what I mean? You know, you know, because I literally took the quest for what? The Holy Grail. Guess what? Oh yeah. Found it. <laughs> he has rewards. Big, huge rewards. You know, really huge. But that right there, I mean, jeez. You don't have to read it in a book. But anyways, but I'm sorry, I, I got drifted a little bit, but uh, I have the second layer, and, and it, it, um, trust me, when, because you have damage, you will still feel different hits, but it won't take long to completely heal. Uh, you'll do it faster, but I started out, I mean, it's, it's all the way down to uh, Magneto 7, uh, um, you know, it's final prototype, and it, it's good. Um, you should heal a lot faster and, and you just got to wear it every time for bed at night. That's all. That's all. You know, after the three, six, three to six months, um, after that, you know, and, and you take it off at night and you put on the movemental cap and you're good. You shield your brain from further damage, you know, cause you'll keep on going, you know, and, but, oh, oh yeah. Legion, Legion riddles your body and your mind so that you, so it's slow, so it, uh, uh, cuts the uh, the livability rate of the numbers of people on Earth. That's why they want to cut it down, Georgia Guidestones. You know they like it because imagine all those people in their in their minds that are the Watchers. You know they're, they're just fucking going, oh gosh, all these damn people are just praying for something. Ah, I just want to kill them all. <laughs> Fucking hate us now, you know, and this happens every civilization. It truly does. It truly does. That's the big reset truth. You know, I mean, hey, people need to pay attention, you know, to your history, and you'll know better. If our politicians paid attention, they would know that they're destroying our civilization as we know it. It may be the Baal beast. It's just been freaking. It's just been a free race. It's the Aries, you know. It's the Aries always ends it. The plume snake for the Aztecas, you know, and the Incas, you know, uh, during that time. Freaking, freaking raw, freaking uh, uh, Inky, Inky, freaking, you know, all those civilizations, they got wiped out towards the end because why? They allowed corruption in and freaking, and it riddled through corruption and, 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 and lies and uh, deceit and, and evil, it just really uh, brings in the snakes. And when you, when you bring in the snakes, it, it's sickening. Uh, and, and if you're sitting up there watching it, you're just like, fuck, I can't believe this shit. These fucking people again? They didn't learn anything from their history. You know? And fucking ask a politician anything about his history. Well, about history of the world since humanity. Since the day one. If they, I guarantee they don't know a damn thing. Oh, well... <laughs> 1943, you know, it, anything past America, America's too young to, uh, um, you know, to be Mr. Badass and know it all. They don't, you know, 
you know, look at the countries that have been lasting for a while, but this is just, a, they want to change things up, that's all. But anyways, this is what I have built right now. I'll put this second layer on, and then uh, after that, it'll be move out on. I'll show you how to do that on the next video. Audi. See you guys.